Hi everyone, it's Ro. Happy fall guys! Today I want to share with you a junk journal that I created. Um, it's it listed in my Etsy shop. It has a fall theme to it. Um, I used a bunch of papers that have, uh, of course, you know, oranges, reds, gold, yellow, um, green colors. And I also used a paper line um, called um, Enchanted Harvest. So let me show you here. It's by Bo Bunny. So I used that also. I used mostly the, um, the journaling cards and die cuts um, from this paper line, but it's so pretty. So it has, um, since it's chanted for us, it has got fairies in it, um, butterflies. So my theme has that, you know, um, butterflies and fairies in it uh, throughout the book. Um, so let me show you the cover. Um, okay, well the book measures about, they usually are typically eight and a half by, oh, this one is six and a quarter. Okay. And the cover is made from cardboard um, that I, um, I think it's a cereal box actually, and covered up with all this uh, lovely paper. Um, it's got two signatures. As you can see, it's pretty thick. So it's the closure are, is a chain here with these clips, and I've got three um, charms, a butterfly leaves, and I think this is a sunflower. But you can definitely add more of charms if you want to. Um, so it's pretty thick. I'm giving you like uh, extra chain with it. So if you if it does get big after you add all your stuff in there, um, you could add the uh, the link the chain here, and then you can make it wider. Okay. So anyway, that closes like that. Okay. And then let me show you the cover. Uh, this the images of the two kids I found on Graphics Fairy. They have free uh, images. And um, so it was an image of these two kids. So I printed out, cut them out, and I just did a collage um, cut out from the uh, Enchanted Forest. Um, that's a die cut. Uh, pieces, you know, from the collection. And I just put this whole thing together and then I uh, scanned it. And so the copy that I have, I went over with pencils and inks. And so um, it looks like a children's, basically how it came out, it looks like a children's um, illustration with all the, the coloring on it uh, with the pencils. And then it says here, Autumn Magic. And um, let's see, this says Memories, Magic, um, Discover right here. Okay, and all covered with Mod Podge to protect it. And I've just got some uh, lace here, lace here, here. Okay, and then the lace is uh, this is black and it's uh, base it's glued on the other side. Okay, and then the spine. We've got this cream um, flowers here, lace flowers, and then this is the back. I just tore some pages here. So it reminds me of like a storybook. Okay, so to get started, oh, let's get started. Let me pull this off. Um, just want to warn you, it's pretty thick, um, so it may take longer than 15 minutes. So you might want to pause and get you something to drink, okay? <laughs> so bear with me. Thank you, guys. Okay, so the first page. Here we go is a pocket. That's from the collection. And then here's just a... A photo, um, um, image, I'm sorry, of a mushroom. Okay. Um, next page. I just left this alone. It's really pretty. It feels like wallpaper. Um, you could definitely put some a photo here if you want to. Okay. So there's lots of places you can put photos, uh, do a lot of journaling, put your memorabilia in there. Um, some pages are just blank, so you could, you know, go ahead and do whatever you want with that. Pa um, papers are tea dyed. Okay, and then I've used washi tape on some of the pages. Um, this one um, is a belly band, and that says Magical Adventure. I used uh, Tim Holtz um, stickers, word stickers on there. Just a couple of tags with some fibers and ribbon. And then here's the back. 
Okay, and again, I've used different papers from different collections, but with all the fall colors. Okay, and then here's this page. It's got a little fairy girl there. From that's from Enchanted Forest. And then here's just a tag with apples. And that looks like burlap. That says, a life without dreams would just be a life. Love that tea dye effect. Okay, here's this page. And then, oops. There's a couple of little fairy, mischievous-looking boys. I think they're boys. Um, that says, I could imagine, discover, and dream. Okay. And then flip that over and you can put a photo here if you want to. Okay. And then here's that envelope, half of an envelope. Okay, and there's an image of the little fairy girl. And here's a journaling card or her photo. Okay, and here's the other side, tuck spot here. Here's a tech spot. And here's um, one of Tim Holtz tickets. You can write something here. And then here's one of the, um, there's a page of butterflies. So I just cut a bunch of butterflies out for this a book. And then here's, um, uh, what do you call this paper? Cellophane, no, not cellophane. I'll figure it out. You, you guys know what I'm talking about. Sometimes when I'm filming, my brain brain cells just decide to go to sleep. Okay, and here's this. Um, that's a pocket here. Okay, and here's a tuck spot here underneath there. And that's a tuck spot under there. Paper. Little pretty leaves, pocket, paper, a couple of banners, and then here's also from the collection, um, cut out a piece of the, this is from a cyclopedia, fussy cut the leaves, okay. and then down here it says, um, I don't know if you can see that, that says magical, and I just put the, it is a magical um, time. Okay. Oops. And just here's a tag. And then this is from a totally different collection, but I just thought I'd go ahead and use her. She's got those pretty butterfly wings. And then here's a washi tape with butterflies. Here's a stamp with fairies on them. Come on. Okay, here's some more leaves that I fussy cut. There's a butterfly. It says blessed life. There's a tuck spot. Here's the other side of that envelope. Here's a journaling card from the collection. That's from the collection. Here's a craft uh, tag. And here's a stamp of a tree with all the leaves that have come off of it. And this says, Cherish Family and Friends. I think this is from Bo Bunny. Okay. And then um, this is a pocket, and I have an image here. Um, so in our enchanted forest, we have people that are half vegetables. 
<laughs> so here's a couple who are peas. And then here's a, looks like a carrot seed, but this is from the collection too. Okay, and then here's a little pocket here with a little tag. Okay. And here's another pocket. And that says treasure every day. And that says Enchanted Harvest, so I just wanted to put that in there to represent the, the collection that inspired me. Um, and then this is the first signature. Okay, oops, sorry, I hit the camera. Okay, and then here's a picture with really pretty sunflowers. Well, they look like sunflowers. Okay, and then here's the next page. Sorry about the glare. I've got my light on above because it wasn't too, it was a little dim in here. Hopefully I can cover up that glare. Let me get over this side. Okay, and here's a pocket with a tag. And then here's a place you can also journal. Then here's another tag. And this page has a big photo mat. And these two are from the collection. Got tomatoes and squash. We've got a large flower on there. Okay. And then this page, just a little envelope. I just uh, for journaling. If you want to, and then here's a little um, sunflower paper clip that I made or glued together. <laughs> okay, and then here's the next page, and then um, this one I fussy cut this out of the 12 by 12. There's a whole bunch of um, same image, and I just glued it on a book page. And some paper, green paper, and it's an envelope. You can put notes in there. Okay, and then here's a tuck spot. And then um, sh this little girl is um, in the collection. I just cut her out, and then I just cut out butterfly wings, and I cut out this tree limb. And here's some plastic leaves. And then here's this page. And then here's our uh, our carrot man that lives in our enchanted forest. And then here's a tag. Okay. And then this page, little pocket here that says memories. Just a little tag. journaling pages, here's a pocket, and then this is um, it's a ribbon with like felt leaves on there, okay, and here's an um, image of a mom and her daughter, There's tuck spots here, and then this is a belly band, so you can tuck it tags here or notes okay. and then that says sprinkle love that's a tuck spot and here's another tuck spot and then these are two butterflies um, so it's dimensional okay and then um, oops this paper has like uh, recipe cards on it and here's a couple of index cards that are tea dyed, so if you want to put recipe on there. And then here's a butterfly paper clip. Okay, and then here's just a pocket. 
simple page. And then this has um, just a tag. That's from the collection. Here's a banner, tech spot, and you can put whatever you want here. It's so pretty, I didn't want to cover it. All those butterflies, mushrooms, little elves or fairies. Okay, and then here's a pocket. There's a giant tag with fibers and ribbons. And, oh, oh, that's just, what is that? Oh tea dye spot <laughs> okay and then here's that and we're almost there in these two pages I cut out trees and then that says make a wish it's a little stamp butterfly and then this one um, I got her also from the internet I think it's graphics fairy tag and she's um, riding on a butterfly okay. and that's from the Enchanted Force collection tech spot There's some washi tape okay and then this is pocket okay that one's not a pocket that's just a pocket and then this here is a pocket and you've got um, seeds so if you want to stick a note in there it doesn't have any seeds but it's a seed packet <laughs> okay and then a um, little uh, tag that looks like a, a jar so you can you know for canning vegetables um, let's see and then this page here okay and that says live Some music notes and then here's a couple of um, journaling tags or, or photo for photos. And then here's a sticker butterfly. And then here's another butterfly. Okay, and then there's the last page. And here you can put a photo if you want to. Okay. All right. And there you go. There's the book. And um, it's in my Etsy shop if I forgot to... Um, <laughs> let you know. Thank you guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.